Me and my family, we run an outfitting business here based out of Carmen, Idaho, Salmon, Idaho. A big part of it is um, horses and mules, which we use to pack into our camps. So last year when they held that chalice adoption, I got approved for two Mustangs and I ended up just getting one. Every day when I brought them home, I would go out and do something with them. And I think it was by the third day, I was already like touching them and petting them. So see, I got them in the end of February, I think by April I already had my first ride on them. The incentive program really helps you and gives you a boost in the right direction because it's kind of like a su support tool. I've got a lot of training tools through it which have helped really build trust with me and my horse and it really helps push you to get started in their training process. This was my first time like adopting a totally untouched Mustang. They're sure-footed, they know what they're doing out in the wilderness. I mean that's where they pretty much grew up. It gave me a lot of encouragement to you you know, keep looking into Mustangs and stuff. So this is Pearl. Um, she's now somewhere around two years old. Uh, got her as a weanling. Um, like the rest of them, they looked a little little rough at the time, and I thought, well, no, she's just, she, there's a Pearl in there. She's super smart, super willing, um, really likes kids, really likes other animals. The incentive is a great word. It really just, I feel like it helps get you through that first year of what it might entail here in Chalice. We have to feed hay for most of the year, um, and that's expensive. So really the money went to buying hay, buying grain. Training isn't cheap, but for those that might not have the experience or the confidence to do it themselves, well now you can help pay for that trainer through the program so that you get one of these fantastic horses, but you're not finding yourself overwhelmed.